Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are at the MJR Waterford Movie Theater with my brother Gannon, and we have a bunch of arcade games right in front of us. I haven't been to this movie theater in forever, but let me show you what they got. They got a stacker machine. They got a key master machine. They got a barber cut light. They got a claw machine filled with specialties. And they also have another claw machine over here where the cool thing is if you put in a $5 bill, you get six free games. So we're gonna go around and we're gonna see if we can win. Let's do this. We're gonna put a $5 bill into the key master machine and we're gonna see if we can win. I can't freaking believe it, man. Here goes nothing. I'm gonna go for this iPad on the very left side. We're going to see if we can win this iPad, guys. Hope you guys are having a great, fantastic day. Like and subscribe. Let me know what your guys' favorite fruit is in the comments section down below. Mine is a pineapple. Ah, it's rigged at the top. That's all right. We're going to try the middle row, and we'll do the bottom row here. So it's going to be pretty freaking awesome. All right. They got a Candyland pop figure in there, which is pretty sweet. I kind of like this Pennywise light, though. Mr. Mint. Let's go for the Pennywise light. Let's see if we can win this. Here goes nothing. And it's rigged as well. We got three tries at the bottom row. I put a $5 bill in here because more than likely, even if it's ready at the bottom, I'm going to screw up at least twice. So <laughs> I put it in here. Um, is there anything that you look? Maybe this Mario Kart toad at the, on the left side again. What do you think? Oh, sure. All right, let's try for this Mario Kart little toad character. See if we can get it. Ah, oh, it's all rigged. You suck, man. Well, I have two extra tries here. I might as well True. go for it again. That's unfortunate. That's okay, though. Ah, oh, it's rigged. And one last try, and unfortunately, we struck out on the key master machine. But we'll give it one more shot. Yeah, it's all rigged. All right, well, that sucks. The good news is, though, is we have a stacker machine right in front of us. And here's the crazy thing, guys. That bug is still on the stacker machine. I'm not even kidding. That bug has been on that stacker machine for at least probably seven years. There is a dead moth or a bug on the third level to the top major prize. There is, it's dead. That's it's, weird. It's been there for a while. It's you, been there you'd forever. Think the vendor, <laughs> once he restock, he does restock the prizes, you'd think, well, there's a dead bug. I, mean, I have my, my, my cleaning supplies, but it adds character. <laughs> we were here. We were here in 2017 making videos all the time, and that bug was still on that machine. Or was still, still inside a stacker. Absolutely disgusting. See if we can win stacker, though. Go for the top. Let's give it a shot. It is echoing in this movie theater right now. Come on, here we go. It's going to have a good time. If you guys also haven't done so yet already, check out my brand new YouTube channel called Phantom Fireside. It's all about scary horror stories. That's also in the description below. Okay. Oh, it rigged me on the second to last block. Striking out today, man, unfortunately. That's all right, though. I'm going to try and see if we can win um, this... Uh, this barber cut light machine. We've actually won from this machine a ton of times before in the past, so it might be ready. This is they got literally four stuffed animals, so we're gonna see if we can get something here. I'm gonna try the middle row. It looks like nobody's won anything out of the middle row, so let's see if we can get it. I'm not the best at these games, but we'll see if we can. Uh, that, we'll go for the raccoon hat. It's a very unusual prize. Okay. It looks like it's been frayed a lot. Ooh. Oh, wow. It's actually telling me that I won, even though it's still uh, still on the string. It's making that sound effect, though. It's having a good time. We'll try one more try. We'll try for the one in the very end. Maybe the one in the very end is ready to pay out. It's kind of weird because it's like he's got this sterling service stuff in the on the glass. So you can't really see too well. I find that... <laughs> Yeah, it's having a good time. God, this is so hard to line up, guys. Yeah, I think it's all rigged, I'm pretty sure. I think I let go right on time and it didn't stop where it was supposed to. All right, struck out on Barber Cut Light. But guess what, though? We have a ball claw machine. Again, you're going to try it. Okay. Let's see if you can win it. 
Gan's gonna try the ball claw machine. Let's see if he can win it. Ooh, it's a drop claw, nice. Ooh, so close. Yeah, I think you can actually use that to your advantage. Let me try one. Yeah. You don't see you don't see too many um, drop claws. They're kind of hard to find. So the cool thing is, is when you lower the claw little by little, you can actually swing the claw and knock stuff to the left side. And the balls are pretty high up, so we actually might be able to knock them in here. I'm gonna go like right there and just move the claw. Look at this. Oh, there goes the purple one. We got eight seconds left. Oh, snap. Push it over. I got one second left. I ran out of time. Two and one. Oh, so close. But yeah, that's a cool technique. You can actually lower the claw down and knock prizes over to the left side, which is pretty sweet. I'm going to try this machine over here. We're going to take full advantage of this opportunity. We put a $5 bill in here and it gives you an extra game, which is very, very nice. So we'll take full advantage of that. Looks like it's been, people have been winning out of this machine. So see if we can win something out of here. Gan's got that purple ball. He's having a good time. The question is, is which one looks the most gettable? And is if is this a drop claw? So I'm gonna pretend it's not a drop claw and I'm gonna go for this uh, giraffe. Okay, it is a drop claw, fantastic. All right, so we can move stuff in a better spot, which is very nice. Oh, almost got the giraffe. I'm running out of time. I got one second, I had to drop it on the koala bear. Koala bear. Oh God, that was not even close. That's okay. I think if I can knock down that red bear, put it into a better spot, we can actually pick one of these things up. So that's pretty sweet. Look at somebody, somebody put all the balls in the, uh, in the hoop over here. That's actually hilarious. I've never seen that before. That's kind of funny. All right, moving back along here. That's going to be kind of my goal. I'm going to try to drop the claw and try to knock those bears forward although it just totally <laughs> it just went down that was my favorite okay then and it looks like it ripped us off too we were supposed to have six games but it only gave us four games I think that's because we were slacking on oh my played in the process. what the heck's going on the I'm heck? not even touching the button what? I didn't touch the button and the claw automatically dropped on its way down Oh my gosh, are you kidding me, Plush Bus? You're killing me, man. What the heck's going on here, dude? That's that's not cool. Yeah, we, we got ripped off of two. <laughs> it just totally ripped us off. I didn't even push the button and the claw automatically went down. This claw is so screwed up, man, unbelievable. Well, that was the MJR Waterford Movie Theater. Um, five bills gives you six games. That was a lie. And um, we actually did win a ball, though, from the ball claw machine. So at least we got that. We tried Keymaster, couldn't win, and then Barber cut light, though. So that was that. Well, that location used to be way better than uh, I remember. We got one prize. Gannon's got the purple ball. We're walking out of the movie theater. Tried all the uh, games. Couldn't really win much there. One, the claw like got broken and it just did just totally ate our money, which was very fantastic. And that was one of the weirdest things. Like the claw machine was like possessed when we were going down to try the uh, the bear. And I didn't even, I just moved the joystick. And by the time I moved the joystick, the claw was already going down, man, without me even pushing the drop claw button. So that's very unfortunate. Both of you guys did like the video, subscribe. Shout out to Gan, Gan's freaking fantastic. Uh, like I said, brand new YouTube channel called Phantom Fireside in the description below. It's all about horror stories if you guys are interested in that. You guys are freaking awesome. I love you all. I'm your host Carson. And of course, go eat a churro. Go eat a churro.